Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's XMS Dan, and today we are putting together the Happy Kitchen boxes from Tokyo. These are all the way from Japan. Um, this one's burger fries, and we're gonna put them together, taste it, try it, see what happens. Enjoy. Powdered burger from just out of water. This is futuristic <laughs> shit, yo. I've seen a guy pulling rabbit out of a hat. This is better than pulling powdered food out of a box. Yo, we ain't playing around. We have to pull all the tiny little pieces and lay them out like we're on some kind of girly cooking show. What's up with that, yo? I don't speak Japanese, I almost this up. Next up, I need a set of girly hands to help cut the place matter. We take pride in cutting out powdered just add water micro french fry boxes. Hello, Check out these bitchin' sellotape skills. If you don't agree, you've got a pimp slap. Oh yeah, and the lovely job of cutting a plastic mixing bowl. First up is those all-important french fries. Oh yeah! Adding the yellow powder into the little cup. Normally I've only got one pair of hands, but today I've got two. I need it for adding two cups of water to this little tiny mixture. Once in, we have to run stir until you get this really weird thick paste kind of texture. Once done, you need to then squash it into the grooves of your finger, make sure the paste goes to all the corners, and then pop it in the micro for 23 to 30 seconds. Boom yeah! Once ready, you pop it out and it'll look like a little triangle of block of cheese. Now you cut it into little tiny tiny french fries using an extremely cool knife you get through with the package. Once cut, you can then put them into this little tiny french fries box. Like so. Next, you can't make burgers without making buns. Let's face it, <laughs> we all like buns. So, same rules apply. Pop the powder into the uh, container and two droplets of water and mix until you get this sort of kind of play doh goo kind of stuff. Once mixed, you'll need to share the solution equally to both sides for the buns. Once the buns are in place, it's now time for the hamburger. Add the sachet into the container, add one droplet of water. Stir until you get the kind of weird brown meat smelling paste, which cannot be good for anybody. Once you have your paste, you need to then scoop it into the meat style grooved hole in the center and squash it into place. Pop the tray in the microwave for 30 seconds. Popping these bad boys out like you're in a rave in Europe. Cut the burger into like you're bashing crap in the street corner of LA. Next up, we're making cheese for these cheeseburgers. Because let's just face it, cheeseburger without cheese is just a burger. So we pour the powder solution into the container. One tiny cup of water. Uh, we stir away until you get that weird cheese ball thing. Now, take the cheese ball, place it on the blue reptile. Squish it out until it kind of looks like molded, cut it up into these little squares and then place onto the burgers. Next up, let's make the coke. Get a small sachet, pour it into the cup and then add as much water as you need to fill it to the uh, Next up will be ketchup. Ketchup. And there you have it. it just had water, powdered food meal, completely a five a day nutritionist balanced diet well kind of well there you have it a complete powdered food meal um, this is the tasting part of it so here we have the lovely hamburger so here's the hamburger with the sauce it just tastes like salty salty mess I don't know the french fries. It's alright. 
Mm -hmm. Hot sauce. Instant fizzy Coca Cola. I don't normally drink Coca Cola, but today it's a different story. That's the best part. That actually tastes like Coke, a bit salty. All right. Thank you, Happy Kitchen. Um, if you'd like to buy your own Happy Kitchen and do it yourself, uh, there's links below in the description box that will tell you where to buy them from. And uh, if you've got any suggestions about Happy Kitchen, please let me know. Thumbs up if you like the video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you like it. See you later.